Hello everybody, Storm here, welcome back to Hearts of Iron for the German Empire. In the last episode, we continued our war with the Allies and the ongoing naval battles in the Channel. Well, particularly the Allied navies and my Air Force have been battling it out, and my Air Force has been kind of having their way with the enemy ships. So that is nice. And we had a couple of naval invasions come through. We threw those back without too much difficulty. And we began planning a new idea for a naval invasion. Primarily a northern plan. Because there's almost no way we're going to get um, control over the channel. So we're going to go around it. And the only real question there is going to be how I'm going to get enough... Um, intel in these couple of areas, but I have some ideas with that. Okay, so that is what we are going to work on. I think we also developed our new submarine design, which is basically bristling with torpedoes, because I want them to sink enemy ships. So that's going to be the plan. Now, I did clear out most of the air battle results, um, mostly just some destroyers that were sunk, but I kept two around because they were somewhat notable. Uh, this one in particular, we sunk the heavy cruiser Salt Lake City and seven destroyers with the loss of 12 naval bombers. I'll take that trade any day of the week. Actually, no, eight. Eight destroyers. Okay. And over here, the loss of a single naval bomber. We sunk two convoys and the USS Texas. Again, a trade I will take any day of the week. So, that's good. We're working on garrisoning over here to try to reduce the uh, resistance. Which, that is coming down, so that's good. Which means we'll be able to get those factories repaired and um, running. Now, one thing that we really haven't done here is work on the Italian front. And another thing I noticed here was this army. You guys. I'm going to redistribute you guys up here. To get ready for England. And let's see. Uh, let's set up a battle plan to push all the way across here. We have our mountain infantry. Again, yes, push all the way there. And... This army. Again, push all the way there. Gonna unpause it, let those guys build up some planning. Uh, we have 2,500 enemy aircraft over here. We have 500 of our own. This is where most of them actually are. And actually, that is where our front line is. So... We're going to have to move them over there. How long until this is ready? Working on it. 
We sunk the HMS Kent. All right. We sunk two light cruisers. We had a major engagement over here. Our convoy sunk. Another light cruiser. And we sunk the USS Enterprise at the cost of eight naval bombers, as well as two destroyers. I will take that trade every day of the week. Do I want some more heavy cruisers? Actually, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put a Bismarck class refit in there. Pakistan has capitulated. Good news. We sunk the USS Lexington at the cost of no aircraft or ships. We sunk the USS Yorktown. It was sunk by the Tirpitz. Very, very nice. Uh, speaking of, let's take a look at our fleet. It's doing pretty well. Um... Repairs, not really necessary. Let's check in to see if there's, uh, kind of any notables in here. Looks like that doesn't really have any history. Hindenburg sunk the Yorktown. Turpitz sunk, well, no, Turpitz sunk the Yorktown, assisted in the Lexington. Hindenburg uh, assisted in the sinking of the Yorktown. The Ludendorff. Actually, is the one who sunk the Lexington. Okay. Assistant sinking Yorktown. Assistant in sinking HMS Barham. Pride of the Fleet. I probably want to move Pride of the Fleet. Once we actually get like a super heavy battleship, we might move that around. Alright, things are going very well there. Alright, so this army actually go ahead and redeploy there. I want a hundred naval bombers and a hundred fighters. Provide some cover there. Uh, 
okay. One of our commanders fell ill. Alright, I think we are ready. Begin. Begin the assault. In Italy? Just a light cruiser. How are we doing as far as naval bombers goes? We can still use more. Definitely use some more naval bombers. All right, we sunk a destroyer. Ausrücken. All right, as soon as this is ready to go, I have not tested this to see if it's going to work. The thing is, all right, we are ready to go. Grand Battle Fleet Doctrine is done. Uh, we're going to need to do submarine operations, and I am going to spend the experience to get that quicker. Because this is going to be predicated on the fact that we can get that naval base quickly. Because if these five divisions are unable to get that naval base... It's going to be a bad time. So. Right. All right, some ausrücken. All right, um, I'm putting those guys out there. I'm going to tell them convoy escort. Is this enough? Insufficient naval supremacy. Destroyer down. Nine destroyers down. Very good. Destroyer down. Destroyer down. Very good. Let's begin the invasion. Free military factories go into naval bombers. Five divisions. 
five divisions. And we just got ourselves some new naval bombers. Nobody there. And there's nobody in the port. Perfect. We had the port. Light cruiser, six destroyers, more destroyers, light cruiser, and nothing there. Okay. Bereit zum Ausrücken. Angetreten. Ihre Befehle. Make it without any engagements. Iran has joined the Allies. Soviet Union has declared war on Iran. All right, fine. without incident. Now I probably don't have good supplies. No, no, we're actually... Uh Somewhat okay. You guys push that way and go. Alright, we'll bring over the rest of the troops once we have some good supply areas. All right, we got our new heavy ship hull. Perfect. I'm gonna unlock the heavy battleship hull, or the super heavy battleship hull. We sunk three heavy cruisers. Norfolk, Exeter, and Frobisher. HMS Malaya has been sunk, battleship. Six destroyers and a light cruiser down. All right, just want to keep an eye on my ships, which we seem to be all right. Three destroyers. Two light cruisers and seven destroyers sunk. 
two destroyers and a light cruiser. Alright, once we take Glasgow and Edinburgh. Alright, how are we doing in Italy? It's going fairly well. Alright. Oh, someone wanted me to check casualties. That one basically just started. Okay, so... On our side of the ledger, we have 2.6 million losses. And on the opposing side of the ledger, we have 4.74 million losses. So pretty lopsided at the moment. So they brought in a lot of troops. And we're still having sabotage. Five destroyers down. Alright, last call's been taken. March into Edinburgh. We sunk the USS Tennessee off the coast there. Alright, now what I need to do is we need to set up some air cover here. We have some close air support. And some fighters. Get them set up. Alright, you guys. Moving to the North Sea. You guys also begin naval striking. Four percent. All right, so you guys split down, you guys split down. All right, next is to get our tanks over here. Cruiser. More naval bombers. Yeah, move all the Marines up to the northern front. Need some rubber. Alright, Indonesia. You can use a little bit more rubber. Your 
Ihre Befehle. So, I'm going to go ahead and give these guys orders to basically take England, All right. along with you guys. Right zum and these guys, why not? Free civilian factories. Continue to build military factories. Oh, we got some enemies. Oh boy, two heavy cruisers down. Pensacola and Minneapolis. Six light cruisers and six destroyers. Some more rubber, apparently. What do we get? We got a French heavy cruiser. All right, good. Okay, so you guys are there. Join in that. Knock out those troops. Wait, what? Yeah, wipe them out, please. Thank you. Yeah, looks like the, uh, the English didn't really have a ton of troops. That's good news. If we can knock out the English and the Irish, that we can deny the Allies' naval bases over here. All right, paratroopers. Get some improved Marines. Get our improved special forces. No. Actually, we are way behind on this tech. All right, let's get improved infantry equipment. Let's continue to crank out fighters. They basically have nothing. Sunk a heavy cruiser, the Augusta.
sunk the USS Mississippi. How is our... Alright, we got a bunch of guys detached. Let's make sure that we are assigning appropriate numbers of ships. Or... Oh, it's only three ships? Did we lose a whole bunch of destroyers somewhere? Somewhere along the line, we lost a bunch of ships. Let's order the whole fleet back for repairs. For the time being. Alright, full of London. Reports from London confirm that the English capital has been captured by advancing German troops. Small arms fire can still be heard from some boroughs, but no significant British forces have been sighted within the city. But it Attachment of Falschenmeggers, which we don't actually have, have stormed the Buckingham Pla Palace, but is believed the royal family is evacuated well in advance of the attack. Alright. As the U.S. is Oklahoma, there's a tendency to disengage, and we sank her. Are we short anything? Well, yeah, heavy tanks. Four destroyers down. Alright, what do we got here? We have the Tier and the Admiral Hipper. Let's get the aircraft carrier through. Let's get the heavy cruiser on there. Alright. And we need to actually design the new battleship. Which I never actually did. Alright, but we are out of time. So, what I will do, if I remember, is get the new battleship design at the next, at the start of the next episode. And then we'll get those battleships under construction. And, uh, yeah. Hopefully finish up taking out England. We're going to need to take uh, those islands there We're going to invade Ireland as well. And those nine divisions there need to be destroyed, which we're working on. Progress in Italy is going well. All right, so... I think with that, we'll end the episode here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.